subscribe and join the Hoho family. We can do our work well and we will not strain and struggles. Father, I pray for Rebecca's wedding. Uh, everything, the event will turn out smoothly and good and everyone is happy. Thank you, Father. I pray that there be enough food to eat for everyone. Lord, thank you enough seat. Thank you, God, and the food will be hygiene and good. Jesus name. And pray for good weather in Jesus name. And keep Yuki healthy and strong and Nori is and body as you eat in Jesus name. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's after work, lots of things to do. Haven't done the packing for the moving out, which will happen very soon. Gonna start packing and I have a big luggage. Because I'm not going to bring everything. Because the current arrangement is we're going to stay temporarily for about 2-3 months in a couple's place while they are overseas. Our honeymoon is for about a month-ish so there's really not much that we can bring anyway and we do hope that um, we will get our semi-permanent housing until we get our flat which will be done only in 2022 that is like 3 years down the road which is quite long so just have to pack whatever I can and to put it in that big luggage and continue to settle on the wedding task always been wanting to show you guys my current hair but it's always in the dark so you guys can't really see but it's a little bit ash grey right? Oh, leave it here cannot be late for work it's about a nine days to the wedding. We are still in the midst of something quite a bit of stuff. Pretty tired. Just can't wait to have the after party for the wedding. I think that will be the happiest moment of our lives. Now presenting to you the quote of the day. Never regret a day in your life. Good days bring you happiness and bad days just give you experience. That's really really true. It's all about what we call reframing. Having a more positive mindset really makes a whole lot of a difference. Thanks to my sister! We're happy to collect this. This is from Roger and Sans. <laughs> when in midst of coming up with the wedding decor, this would be the time prints for the trees and then there's also this, our hashtag. I'm also smelting for like, it would be the groomsman's one and then this would be John's. This would be mine. It's for the gate crash, but I'll be wearing this for honeymoon while John will be wearing this for gate crash first. We are painting, doing stuff for the decorations. Busy, busy, busy. Last Saturday as a single, oh my goodness, and I'm spending the whole day here working but it's good to get work over and done with as well. Morning dear ho-hos, it's the last lap for us. I'm waiting for John. Today we're gonna recce the park area where the bridesmaids and the groomsmen plus John and I will be going to shoot for a little bit after the gate crash. A lot of wrecking and scouting and I hope I don't get any more bites because I have a lot of bites already. Like you guys can see my whole body actually I have like about six to seven bites. Just lots of mosquitoes around here. After we're gonna have brunch, then we're gonna check our hair because the hairstylist wants to make sure that the color is what they want. So we're just gonna go there. We're gonna decorate the car with Hello Kitty bridal gift that my mom's friend gave. And then I'm gonna spend some time with the whole family. It's just gonna be a whole family dinner. Uh, John couldn't find parking because it's a Sunday. 
So I'm on my lonely search to recce the place and this is the first place that I've recce for the photo shoot. It's quite a nice bridge and it has like some grasses and water and so so I think I'm definitely gonna KIV this place. Like a, I thought it was a croc but it's a monster music. Last year we came ah, yes, oh. for the wedding. It's really last year, yeah, but last year. <laughs> Hello, you look sure I'm a person. I should see who I identify. So we're here at the whole family dinner and this is the last whole family. So let's invite my family members to say something for me. Oh yeah, I want to show my mom's cooking first. She made the herbal chicken mishua. Okay, so I'll pass it to my brother first. I'm happy that you're getting married next week. Hope that you'll be, um, you'll be happy. I will miss you a lot. But I'm sure that um, we'll still meet very often. La. As in, it's not the end that after marriage, you won't see us again. I'm pretty sure that we'll meet as a family very often. This last meal is very important because it's where we actually eat together as a whole family. Yeah, so, yeah. Thank you, boy. Oh, to Sister Ho. Hey, uh, Rebecca. Like, <laughs> um, no words can say what I want to say now, but I love you. Even though you get married, we will still be sisters forever. Do come back and, and see your Rachel Zay and your mommy, daddy, and boy boy often. <laughs> And Yuki. And Yuki, Yuki is with me. Rebecca, I'm very happy that you have found, you know, your loved one and finally you are getting married, settling down. I wish uh, you and uh, Jonathan a very blessed marriage and, you know, that you will have a lot of uh, good times and we welcome you back, you know, uh, anytime to uh, fellowship with us. May God bless your marriage richly. I want to bless you and Jonathan have a blissful marriage, happiness, and learn to grow with each other. Also come back uh, for our meal again together, fellowship together. Yeah, we will miss you. Okay, when you are not around, we will go to our room in eh? Rebecca. Yeah. <laughs> so you will have to come back and see us yes. again and yes. have uh, dinner or lunch with us together. Okay? Okay, yeah, thank, you, care, family. Uh. thank you family. Thank you family.